Try not to break them. Why are you here? No, hello. Hi, how are you? Cut the shit, Robert. I'm no child anymore. Fine. Cut the accent. Whatever suits you. We need to bring you back in. No. We need you. I need you. And I need no more lies from you, Robert. I'm done. For good. Please, Victoria. Trust is a sparse commodity, and you have all of my wealth. I need your help. You always were one for surprises. You didn't seem to mind in Prague. You weren't a traitor in Prague. I was never a traitor, just a good spy. Now put the PDA and the reader in the bag and toss it here. You know I can't do that. I don't think you have a choice. I can hear everything you cannot say. Permit me to be Fidos. What will our first meal be together when I come home from my studies? <sighs> it would be simple. A knedel soup. A plain piece of meat with horseradish. And for dessert, I will think of something very sweet. How's your father? <sighs> We're not in contact so much. What? What happened? My mom got back in touch and he pushed me away. I was always a disappointment, you know that. No, no way. Jane, your father was so proud of you. I bet he's just bad with words. I'm sorry. I'm crying. No, you're right. I guess I'm the one that grew up. I miss him. Oh, yes. Okay, I'll get to this. Oh, oh. Yeah. Miss Bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Bigger. A whole big chunk right there. <laughs> a little bit. Yeah, you got some baby hairs. I know. My they mom. can get they can get annoying, but I pull those out. All right. <laughs> I'm a perfectionist. Don't pull mine out. <laughs> no, no, I won't.